nettle harvesting. How do you harvest nettle and not get completely eaten alive? I don't know if you've touched the stem of a mature nettle plant. If you have, you remember it. I know that. I have. And I'm very sensitive to nettle. If I do touch it like that, I will have a rash for several days that's pretty painful. And so over the years I've learned how to live with nettle. And one of the foolproof ways to harvest it without getting stung is actually to harvest the tender tops of a young plant. The plant only develops those stingers as it ages. So if you have a young, immature nettle plant, you will be able to harvest it even without gloves. I mean, do a test first, right? Test the plant, don't get too involved unless you know it is young enough to harvest without gloves. And I mean young enough like a plant that might be about this tall. Now, your variety of nettle may also vary, but the plants that we have here, when they're young, we have a variety that has, you know, it's a nice annual plant that puts on, you know, puts out young little new shoots in the spring, and you can just go through and cut those off or pinch them off, and you're not gonna get stung if you catch them at the right time. And when they are that young, you will be able to actually use the whole stem because the stem is very tender at that point so you can even put that stem in your soups and stuff it just so just pick pop it in your soup and you're done so it's actually a very good time of year to harvest when all those plants are so young so that's my biggest tip is just find those young plants and take care of business right there find more nettle information on the fresh bites daily website and find lots of stuff about fun herbs and spices